guys, what is good? I hope you're all doing well. I'm back with another video and I am doing my 10 June 21st outfits. I know it's not June 21st anymore, I literally am over it. I just feel like, to me, it's still June 21st, like, that's what fits. So, that's what I'm doing. We're still doing it, we're going with June 21st. I don't care if it's July the 19th, July the 5th. Whatever they're saying now, because I can't be asked. I honestly can't be bothered anymore. It's stressing me out. So it's June the 21st for me, okay? Leaving it at that. Before anyone wants to say anything, just... That's that. Anyway. Yeah, so I'm doing my 10 June the 21st outfits. We've got loads of dresses because it will be the first weekend we can go out. Like, out, out. So we need to dress all out. So I've got quite a few dresses, but I did also put a couple of long trouser options in there. Ooh, I don't know why I keep stuffing the tr these trousers because they're really loud. Like every second, I'm like, don't know why I keep doing that. That really hurt my hand. <laughs> Ow! Do you know what? I really don't like standing up. Like I feel like I look really weird. Like I'm standing in a really weird position. Like why am I standing like this? I'm not hunched back. I don't know what to do. I need to just stand up normally, like, hey, how do I stand? I, I'm really, this is stressing me out. Anyway, yeah, I'm doing June 21st outfits. I'll show you all the outfits. Shoes, accessories, I mean, shoes, bags, not on all, but on some. You'll see. You will see. And yeah, let's just get straight into it because no time to waste. Also, this is not like a haul, so everywhere, all outfits are from different places. There are certain things from the same place, but then there's a lot of places, a lot of things from different places. I'll link everything in the description, and obviously I'll talk you through when I've got it on, but just letting you know. This isn't like a pretty little thing haul, misguided haul, it's like a small rounder. It's got, it's got a few outfits from a few different places. So, yeah. But let's just get into it, because let's go on to the first fit. Okay, so this is fit number one, cutest dress ever, cutest heels ever, so I'm going to show you as much as I can. Little orange clear stilettos, and then on the toes, they've got like little diamantes, can you see that? This outfit is so cute, like the little asymmetrical pattern, ribbed, what I will say though, this dress is tight, I should have got it in eight, so I would recommend sizing up because it is tight, like, you know when it's like, oh my god, you're gonna make up, ruin your makeup, like, you need to put this on before you get dressed, because it's a no from me, my belly is so bloated, help, but yeah, this outfit is so cute, I love it, this is the back, also I didn't say, but in each fit I'm gonna do like a mirror picture and upload it in the corner of the video so you can see the full details, the full fit, but, and I might even add a bag in that one, because I haven't added a bag in this, but, this is just so cute, I love this one. So this is from Pretty Little Thing, this dress. The shoes are from Ego. And yeah, this is the first fit. I can't even remember how much this stuff was, but like I said, I'll link everything in the bio, but I know, I just remember that this dress was cheap. Like I think it was like under 12 pound or something. It was cheap and it's so cute. First one is a success. This is outfit number two. I love this dress. I literally love it. It's so cute. It does like holiday vibes a bit for me, but I do really like it. Like it's just got that mesh overlay detailing, the little loose bit at the front, and it's backless, which is just like an extra added bonus. So cute. I pair actually paired this one with some black lace up tie heels. Stilettos again, and these are from Pretty Little Thing as well. And then I um, paired it with my little black Prada bag. This dress is also from Pretty Little Thing. It's so cute, it's really good material as well. And it's just so comfy, like, I don't know, I just really do like this one quite a lot. It's just so, I don't know. It's just like that abstracty vibe again. And it's, I know, orange again. It's like orange and browny tones again, but I promise they're not all. I think these are the last two that are orange. I think the first two and the last two. But yeah, so cute. I could also pair this with orange heels, but I think the black looks a lot better because there's like darker vibes going on, like darker colours involved. So I really think that the black looks really nice, if I'm honest, but this outfit is so, so nice. I'm definitely gonna be wearing this out on a night out somewhere. Not sure where. Don't know when yet, I don't know where, but somewhere this dress is gonna be making 
an appearance, okay? Yes, it is. Also, my hair is struggling because so annoyed. <sighs> just, I didn't think about bun, putting hair, clothes on, off, on, off. Bad idea because it's just getting caught every single time and it's just like stressing me out. But whatever, we'll get over it. This is only out for two and it's already a mess, but the end of this video, my hair's gonna be like flyaways everywhere. It's not even gonna look good. It ain't gonna be pretty. This one is one of my faves, for real. But then a lot of them, I'm gonna say that about all of them because I love a lot of these outfits. But you just wait and see, you wait and see. I know a boy just like you. He's a snake just like you. Now, are you actually kidding me? This outfit, I, if anyone doesn't like this, then I don't like you, okay? Because this is just like, this is so in at the moment, like this abstract like print color and luminous heels. Cause I've got a pair of blue heels, right? Would look cute. But these green heels, because I think that there's less green on the dress, they look better. Like I literally love them little green leather mules. They've got like a chunky block triangle heel. So cute from Ego. Again, Ego is the prime of the luminous heels. This dress from Pretty Little Thing. So cute. It's really like thin little material though. I'm not gonna lie. But like even this little detail here, like the little crossover, you can't just wear it as one strap. Like it comes like a normal dress, like you see the back. Sits up normal straps, but this is how the model wears it. So this is how Rome is gonna wear it. <laughs> but also I'm so annoyed. I've ordered a bag. These squeaky shoes are so squeaky. I've ordered a bag, exact same colour as these heels. But it's not come yet, so I can't put that on. But imagine this with a little green, little green mini bag. So cute, cutest thing ever. Also, disclaimer, disclaimer. If you hear any screaming, it's because little, my little brother Harry is watching the football game. England, they just scored, so I was off camera, so you won't hear it. But I heard it. It was crazy. He was screaming his head off. But anyway, hey, we move. But yeah, this one is so cute. I literally adore it. And again, this dress was like under £12, I think. Or £12 maybe. Around the 12 to 15 benchmark, I'd say. But it's just such a little cute, like, nightclub in, out-out dress. I love it so much. Can we actually just have an applaud for this outfit, please? Because I'm done. I'm finished. Pink, pink, pink. Obviously, we've got a bit of an orange. Got that tones again. Yes, if you haven't noticed already, this is the exact same style dress, but different pattern, obviously different colour scheme. But I think I might love this one even more. I'm not even joking. Like the, these heels, by the way, you all need to go and get them. I'm going to buy them in every other colour, I think, because these are so nice. Pink, like tie, chunky, tie up, knotted heels. They are so cute. And then I've just paired with it this little pink crossbody bag that I just put on my shoulder. This is from. Stratosferius. Shoes are ego, so cute. These are honestly my favorite pair of heels. You wanna be seeing me in this outfit in a club. I don't know when, I don't know where, but you will. Cause it's just too cute not to. Go away, go away. Oh my God, look at this dress. Look at this outfit actually. I'm wearing the pink heels again, but I could wear green, orange, blue, anything, but I just think the pink look cute. This is actually for my one of my races outfits in terms of the races, new market races. So cute. I literally am obsessed with this dress. This is from Motel Rocks. I've had it for so long, but I've just not been able to wear it yet because obviously we can't go out. But it's just like a little mini mini satin dress. So figure hugging that she sticks. It's not got that static energy. It's really weird actually. I don't know why it's got that. It's such good material. This one was more expensive, like 40 quid, I think. But it's so nice with the little droopy bit at the front. I do, again, I've ordered a pink bag. I do have my other pink bag, but I have like, brought like a little mini handbag, which would look way cute with this. Little outfit, but cutest fit or not. Imagine me at the races, like new market races, Liam's in a suit. It's gonna be cute. Get some cute pictures that day, banging pictures that day. And then this is the back. Have I shown you the back yet? Back is just like, ties up there. And that's how it like cinches you in a little bit. If not, it would just be really flowy. But this is just so cute. I am obsessed. Got adjustable straps as well, which is really handy. What is this? Number five. Number five. Five. We've got five more to go. Five down, five more to go. Five down, five more to go. Five down, five more to go. This is number six. 
and blazer, oversized blazer style dress. This one, I've added a little bra underneath and I've got the bright blue heels on. I love these heels. I'm really sad that I've not actually incorporated them into an outfit already in this video, but they're so cute. I love like pink blue. How cute is that contrast? Like, so nice. Bright blue heels from Pretty Little Thing. They're like the toweling material. Do you know what I mean? And they're little mules, little toweling material mules. With like the knot, at, oh, I can't even stand up. With the little knot at the front. And then this is the oversized blazer dress. Now I will say this bit here, see how it splits? A little bit risky. It is a little bit, I probably will pin it when I go out because it's a little bit risky. Got it from, I saw it first, just an all normal oversized, oversized blazer and I got it in a size 10. So I could wear it as a dress. And then I put on this little white bra on underneath just for a little bit more detailing. And because it's quite like, boom, do you know what I mean? It's like a little bit booby. So the little bra adds a little bit of detail, I think. No bad for this because I just thought this was quite cute, just like plain, little plain cute outfit, if I'm honest. But you could add like quite a lot of different colors bag, blue, white bag, you know, whatever, whatever you feel. I'm really into that blazer style dresses at the moment. You'll see, um, you see how I am in a minute because then maybe, maybe it might be giving you a secret, but there might be another one in a minute. <laughs> Just maybe, there might be, don't know. But yeah, I love them. But this one's from I saw it first. I'll say it's not the best quality. I mean, it's like, does the job and it looks cute, but it's not double breasted. And I like my blazers to be double breasted, but I got it as a bargain. It was like, I think I got like 50% off, so I got it like under 20 quid and for a blazer that's quite good. But then you get what you pay for and it's not double breasted, so I should have just paid 30 quid and got a double breasted one, but you win some, you lose some. Also, orange heels will go this as well. I tried my orange ones on, they look banging, but I just wanted to put the blues ones on because I've not worn them yet and I love them. Let's do outfit seven. I told you, I'm obsessed with blazer dresses, I told you. This is banging. This is what I call a double-breasted blazer. This is exactly the blazer I wanted the pink one to be, and it's not, we move. I have actually went in for a one from Boohoo, pink one, to come back in stock. It's literally that same, but it's double-breasted, and I just want one. I just need it double-breasted, like with shoulder pads. This one from Misguided, by the way. It's got shoulder pads, thick, it's just thickness, you know what I mean? Just that thick. So much better. This one I've not just ch chose to put a bra on, but I would just pin it there slightly. I mean, I don't think it would do anything, but just, I mean, I don't think it would show anything really, but just for a bit more of security, I'll pin it there, because I like the no color, like the nothing underneath look. With this one, for the sake of this video, I paired with this with orange heels, the orange ones with the little diamante over the toes. But I'm not gonna lie, I probably would wear the pink ones, and I am not gonna keep putting them on because you're probably just thinking, Romy's putting on a pair of heels on, but I love them. They just look so good, the pink and the blue. My hair's winding me up. It's winding me up. This is just such a cute little one. Misguided, like I said. This is actually from the tool section. Got it in a size 10 again. I was worried it's gonna be massive. This is like perfect size for me. This is literally oversized base, this is what I wanted. Like baggy, loose, casual vibe, but it looks so sick. Literally looks sick. And I love it, I'm really vibing with it. And now I'm gonna go on to outfit eight, I think. I love to count, eight, nine, 10, yeah, three more. Three more, this is the last dress by the way. Outfit number eight, boys and girls. So this was actually like a bit different. Well, it's very different on the last ones, I've just actually scratched myself. No bright colors, very neutral. Leather on leather, ow, that hurt. But leather shorts, little leather pants and little leather crop top, little bandeau. Number, I've gone for plain clear heels for this one, keeping it neutral. And then I've gone for a little cute shoulder, like, I don't really know what shape you'd call that. I don't know what shape that is, but that's what it is, on the shoulder. It's kind of like, it's not like the shape of the Dior, it kind of is like that weird little shape of the Dior that's got the curve, obviously it's nothing like a Dior lad, but you know what I mean. You know where I'm going with it, I think. But on the shoulder, so cute. This is the back, plain leather from, this one's a lot more neutral, like I said. Need definitely a bit more retirement with this, so I'm so pale at the moment. It doesn't really, it's not really doing me very much justice, I'm not gonna lie. I look in the mirror, I was like, oh, is that you? I need a tan with this, because black just washes you out anyway. 
um, when you're pale like me at the moment. So I've not picked hand in so long, so I'm trying to not. You could also do this with like bright shoe if you wanted a bright bag, but I just wanted to keep it neutral, you know, because I've had a lot of bright colours. But I do love bright colours, so at the moment I'm really, really enjoying them. But yeah, so let me show you where everything's from. Shoes, ego, pretty little thing. Ego, again. Shorts, pretty little thing. Top, pretty little thing. Bag, pretty little thing. This is my ninth outfit. So leather, tra leather trousers, again. Camel though today. T today, I mean this time. Got like the stitching down the front from Misguided. Then I paired them with some like white quilted mules from, you guessed it, Ego. Um, and then this little bandeau, little thin strap. Um, ow, that hurt. Top from Zara. Such a cute little outfit. It's really plain, really simple, but you know, it's still cute. And I wanted to add some like trouser ones in there because I know some people don't want to wear dresses and stuff. So I thought I'd show a couple of other options, but I like this one. The trousers are really cute. They are a little bit loose on me, but to be honest, I'd rather them like this than so tight. Like the ones at the start, if anyone remembers from the start of the video, that I literally can't breathe because I would prefer that. Like going out, you want to be comfy, even though you forget when you're drunk, but my phone is going off. But yeah, this one's such a cute little one. Not really much to talk about because it's just like quite plain, quite boring, but it is still quite cute. Okay. Oh my God, if that's been like that, no, drop me out. If that's been like that for that long, has that been like that and it's been cutting my face out? Anyway, I'm showing you the last outfit. This one's very, like, a lot more casual. I'd wear this probably, like, to drinks, like, a bar. I would actually wear it clubbing. I'm lying. I would wear this clubbing. But like I said, I wanted to, like, put, like, a more casual outfit in there. So that's why I went for skinny jeans, which I'd only ever wear skinny jeans with heels, in my opinion. But, you know. Black little lace-up, stiletto heels again. This little halter neck. I don't really know what you call it. Tie wrap top from... ASOS, the um, As You collection. This little bag is from Sheen. These jeans are from Zara. So cute, I love them. As I say, I never really wear them because I don't really wear skinny jeans. But for clubbing, like going out to a bar with heels, they look cute in my opinion. I really like this outfit actually. Not gonna lie. Ain't gonna lie to you. But anyway, my battery's about to die for about the seventh time today. And it's stressing me the fuck out. So I'm just gonna end the video here because if it dies and I've got to re-record this, I probably honestly will just like, I don't know, I'll give up. I will give I'll give up. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video and my fits, my little 10 June 21st fits. As I said, I'll link everything in the description so you can go buy anything if you want it. And I'll catch you all next time. Also, can I just say, told you my hair would be a mess. Look at that. What is that? Messy bun. But all of it's falling out the back. I just, oh, that's my top. <laughs> it is all falling out the back though. But anyway, I'm going now.